Well, if you were a child of the 80s like we were, you probably remember a movie called Short Circuit. <laughs> and it appears that Johnny Five is still alive. He's right here. <laughs> well, not actually. What we're looking here is the MBOT Ranger by Makeblock. And it's a fantastic do-it-yourself robot kit that you can create robots of all different shapes and sizes. Well, this is pretty cool because this is just taking that whole education thing and uh, game playing to that next level, right? This is uh, something that you build from scratch at home. You take all the parts and you put it together, but it's more than just nuts and bolts. This is actually taking uh, a computer and some engines and some batteries and connecting it all together and then going into the app that um, you download onto your phone or use your iPad or use a PC and then you can set up little programming instructions as well. Yeah, it, it looks like something adults could enjoy, but it's really for kids to get them excited about STEM, which really stands, it's an acronym for Science, Technology, Engineering, and Math. And there's a little bit of everything in here because not only are you learning to build it, and what I like about it is there's no soldering required, so mm -hmm. you don't have to do anything like that, but you can still build it and then learn to program, which gives you coding skills on mm -hmm. top of just you know, the reward of putting something together. And it's cool because these guys uh, can be built into a number of different configurations. There's actually three different ones for here, but before we go into those, um, there's also sensors that it comes with. So there's five different sensors, so we can uh, do something like on the bottom here, I've got the line following sensor, and up top here we've got the ultrasonic sensors. It can actually pick up and detect noise levels as well. So when you actually go into the app, which I'll show you here, and where you can actually control it once you've built the platform and decide how you want to use it. I can drive it back, forward and back. And as you can see here, my sensors are reporting uh, back to me. What's cool about this, if I just show you here, we can actually go into um, the edit mode here. If I just go into the little bot there, um, let me just do that here, uh, design. I go into the design mode and as I was talking about there, really easy for me to take controls and I just drag and drop them onto the page and it allows me to uh, change the functionality in the, in the robot. Uh, Andy, you had mentioned, or I had mentioned, there's three different types. That's right, you can make uh, what this is called the Land Raider and you can see it's got you know, tank tracks on it. There's also a Nervous Bird, which is a two-wheel self-balancing robot, which is kind of interesting to teach kids about how self-balancing works. And also the Dashing Raptor, and that's a three-wheeled three robot that you can get some serious speed with. So it's kind of cool because a lot of times with kids, you know, they, they get a toy, they play with it, and then they get bored. Mm -hmm. But here, this is a three-in-one. So even if you, you've gotten, you know, bored with, say, the Land Raider. And you can configure it with the bigger library that uh, the company has to offer with up to 400 different pieces. So that really expands the opportunity. That's right. And there are also all free online educational tools to learn more about programming and finding different ideas and designs and oh. programs that you can make for your MBOT Ranger. So if you have a little, little one out there, you want them to get excited about education, about science, technology, engineering, math, or all of the above, you got to check this out. It's from Make Block, and this is the MBOT Ranger. Can we do the robot out? <laughs> Can you make this do the little robot out without coming off the tail? <laughs> Let's see. Oh, oh. Let's take it over.